So I'm here at the uh, water cube with uh, Mr. Batch, if it's possible. Ms. Finish and Kut. Ms. Finish and Kut. Please, Ms. Finn, could you explain, yeah, tell a little bit about yourself and what you're doing here? Yeah, I'm uh, Ethiopian. I'm a consultant working on water resource management mainly. Okay. So, as you know, this is a big event on water, so I'm coming here in connection to uh, the work I'm actually doing in Ethiopia. Okay, is your first time here? No, it's my second time, I came two years ago. Okay. And uh, I've really been happy and it gives you a lot of opportunities to meet people of the same profession. Yeah. People have been dealing on the professions that you're working in different parts of the world. This gives you the opportunity to exchange idea and to discuss with people of the same profession and also look forward in towards what mm -hmm. the world is mm -hmm. all about regarding water resources management. So it's so, a opportunity, yeah. And so how come water resources management? Water resources, yeah, you have to manage your the entire yeah. water resource. We know it's a broad subject. Exactly. In uh, water, when you talk of water resource management, it, it goes all the way, irrigation, drinking water, even go to the, <clears throat> I mean, all the, 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 the uh, rainwater thing and food aspects, you know, it's a very wide uh, subject, so mm -hmm. water management is quite a very wide and mm -hmm. diversified area, particularly for countries like ours in Ethiopia, where yeah. we really need to yeah. manage our water resources. And you've been, uh, how long have uh, been active in Ethiopia? Oh, concerning this subject immediately? Yeah, I mean, I've been running this consulting firm for the last 12 years, mm -hmm. and we have done a lot of, quite a lot of things for yeah. water management. And uh, previously, I was working for the Ministry of Water Resources. Okay. It was the same area. Mm -hmm. So also my studies are also in the same field. Uh, yeah, it's a very quite interesting uh, subject. And yeah. uh, it's, it's really quite good attention and also a great deal of exchange of idea and also knowledge. Okay. What would your uh, advice or I mean, input for the world would be if people ask you a question, what's so important about water? Yeah. You know, we can see it from, from different perspectives, you know, there has always been a big gap, knowledge gap between mm -hmm. what uh, we developing countries require mm -hmm. and what uh, I mean, the developed world can offer in terms of mm -hmm. technologies. Mm -hmm. So if you want me to say something, yeah. please, to the, uh, I mean, to the developed world, please, we need those technologies which are appropriate to our solving our own problems. You know, we cannot go to high tech whereby myself was educated in uh, the Western Urban Oriented uh, I mean, curriculum. So we need our standard, we need all those types of researches, mm -hmm. technologies, which match our needs. So to address, I mean, at the level that we are here, you know, there's so much developed science now, yeah. but those are, may not be applicable to our case. So exactly. we are just saying that let's, let's focus on appropriate technologies, adoptable to our, actual problems adopt to our situations that's the message really okay to pass. yeah well thank you very much <laughs> hope you have a good week uh thank you yeah thank you very much yeah.